This video was made possible by the EA Game Changers program. What are you doing? Well, hello, my beautiful friends. It is being Chris here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are going to take a look at The Sims 4 Cottage Living. And yes, it is so exciting. Let's go and read a little bit real quick. So welcome to The Sims 4 Cottage Living raise or befriend animals. Chickens and cows can provide sims with eggs and milk. Llamas provide wool for crafts, just don't get spit on. Wild birds share their sweet songs and rabbits will freely roam, but keep an eye out for mischievous foxes. Live off the land. Whether sims grow their own produce, forage in the wild, or visit the village market, fresh is best. Up for a challenge? Try growing oversized crops to enter into the competition at the Finchwink Fair. Embrace the countryside. Henford on Bagley is nestled in the cozy countryside where everyone knows everyone. Pack for a lovely picnic or lose yourself in a cross-stitch session. Get to know the locals at the Gnome's Arms Pub and learn about the town from your neighbors. Enjoy the simple life. Benefit from higher quality food while using the new Simple Living Lot Challenge. This new lot challenge will require your Sims to cook with fresh ingredients for each meal. Will your Sims be up for the challenge? Well, let's take a look my friends all right so welcome to henford on bagley ah i wish i wish i wish there was more lots this world is beautiful but i feel like there's not enough lots so we're gonna go ahead and take a look we're gonna move our family we're gonna move our blakely family into a new house and ah goodness gracious there's so many uh nice neighborhoods we have so we have the finchwink which is I'm sorry, Finchwick. Nestled along the River Bagley, the old mill village of Finchwick prides itself on its bustling and close-knit community. Its historic square features a pub and quaint stalls amid a flowering garden. Perfect for a little window shopping. Taurus and locals a like flock to the weekly village fair where Finchwick's mayor makes a special appearance to judge entries and gossip about the latest happenings. So you do have a house here. You have uh, five Crumple Bottom Street. You also have the Scott family right here. And um, you have one Crumple Bottom Street. This is also a residential. I like how you see the lot challenges when you hoover over or hover over. I always get those two words mixed up. So it tells you wild foxes, wild foxes, and uh, wild foxes and simple living. Okay, so that is the finch wink. No, it's not wink, it's wick. Oh, goodness gracious. All right. So then over here, we have the old new Henford. Oh, that is a lot of information to read. I am not going to read that. That is a whole lot. <laughs> um, But we do have a lot here that is unfurnished and it does have a lot challenge which is the wild foxes and off the grid this is a 50 by 40 lot for six thousand we also have the three old mill lane the lot challenge of course is wild foxes so i believe all these houses do start with wild foxes all right as the lot challenge we have a new start um a resident and the um, lot treat is homey and we also have the Watson family, which we saw in the trailer. Yes, uh, lot traits are brazen breezes, homey, and the lot challenge is wild foxes. So that's this section over here. So over here, we have the Bramblewood. The natural beauty of these woods have long provided a picturesque place for many wild rabbits, birds, and foxes to call home. Whether secreting a small surprise under Sophie the snail, Bring in an easel to paint the serene Cordelia Falls, foraging for wild mushrooms, or finding romance among the ruins on the Isle of Volpe, or Isles of Volpe, any sim would be transformed by a day in the Bramblewood. Ah, so here is uh, a lot right here. I believe this is where you would go to find like the choco berries and see the bunnies and the birds and all that great stuff. Here is a rental. Wow we have a rental that's really cool here is a rental and we have moody and mcmillan 
um, wild foxes is their lot challenge and that's a 40 by 30 lot. I'm pretty sure I saw a 64 by 64 lot. I have no idea where it is. I must be seeing things. Here goes Cordelia's secret cottage. Oh, 19,000. So that's like a starter home. That's beautiful. So before we go ahead and enter in, I just want to make sure that we're not up oh, here it goes. That's 64 by 64 lot. Let's go ahead and um, I'm, I'm actually going to evict this family real quick. We're going to evict the family. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. We're going to keep our furniture and we're going to keep it furnished for now. And we're going to go ahead and take a look. We're going to go ahead and see how beautiful this house is. Oh, I cannot wait to see it. It's my first time looking at this since the trailer. I am super duper excited and I hope you all are too. It looks like an amazing pack. So let's go and take a look. Okay, so we're going to give Megan a new aspiration. She is going to take on the country caregiver let me say that again she's going to take on the country caregiver my friends um they want to tend the countryside and befriend all animals and critters uh reward trait is a natural nature cons conversationalist sorry apologize oh gosh darn it uh nature conserve oh my god chris why do they have to use such big words Nature con con conversationalist sims have improved relationships with animals, allowing their animals to live longer, happier lives. Rabbits and birds will bring them more gifts, and they can interact with plants in unique ways, receiving more yield from harvest. They will also receive free grocery delivery, and when residing in Henford on Bagley, a discount on their bills. I love that. I love it. So we're going to give her that and then she needs to purchase one cow chicken or llama or your on your home lot but let's go and take a look i feel like i'm losing my voice all of a sudden i haven't even been recording like for a half hour yet look at this gorgeous house oh wow let's go of course i don't have my cheats on or do i i do let's go and take a little look we're gonna let i uh, we're gonna let let it run look at that nice i uh, gate area oh i love that do we have any ponds around i don't see any ponds we actually messed around with ponds in the um in the patch notes for a little bit remember that in winter they do freeze they do freeze in winter let's go inside we're moving a little faster now Ta -da! so this is like the entryway all right oh i like the stairs i like the uh the brick as well oh, that rooster look at this door what's in this door oh <gasps> the kitchen oh that fireplace is phenomenal oh my goodness so pretty oh look at the okay the cabinets are okay i love the hood right here with the rooster on it ah oh, so very nice so this is a door to the back the back side the back the back <laughs> the back door chris here is the dining area very nice um look at that picture right there oh that's so pretty i love the little bunny rabbit oh so pretty okay this probably takes us back out to the like the, oh there's another little hallway so what is this over here this is a bathroom oh i love those photos so pretty oh all right oh we don't want to watch her go to the potty we don't want to watch her go to the potty so we're going to go out to the living room real quick. Oh, I messed it up. My gosh. This is a very big house. I mean, all the detail, all the detail. You have a nice size, size kitchen. You have a nice size area out here to like uh, have some family gatherings and stuff. You even have a nice little area out in the backyard. And there goes our oversized crops. Ah, oh, that's going to be so exciting. I cannot wait to take a look at that. Uh, we have a little pond in the yard as well. So this is basically the perfect lot. We do have a shed already to purchase an animal. And we also have the chicken coop. Oh, we got the name of the chicken. Ah, purchase chickens, name chickens. But this area right here is just so pretty. Oh, it is gorgeous. Love it. Look at the moon. Oh, that moon is huge. Yeah, so let's see what we have around here. 
we also have i don't think this is our, our area over here uh or is it is it our area i don't know but it's let's take a look let's see what nope that's not our area this looks like i don't know uh an overgrown area um not really sure what you can do in there but look at the oh wait until we take a look at the debug items oh gosh all right so yeah so we're going to go ahead and we're going to try to purchase a couple things real quick for megan uh megan we're going to come over here and we are going to purchase a chicken purchase a black hen a rooster okay so let's see what it says uh, a black hen a hen can lay eggs while they are in a coop if you have a hen and a rooster then hen may lay hatchable eggs so we need a hen and a rooster let's do a brown hen and a brown rooster love it oh let's go and do that and then we're going to go and you can assign chickens what ah oh, let's take a look uh scattered feed nearby name chicken gather roman chickens to coop call chickens out oh let's call the chickens out let's do it you don't have to sleep let's go do it megan wake on up why are you sleeping in a bunk bed anyway my friend hurry on up we're gonna hurry oh this little kid is hungry Jaden, Jaden's tired oh he's so sleepy okay but hurry on up let's go see let's fast forward a little bit go outside let's take a look oh my goodness ah uh, they are so adorable oh i love them that is so cool um what did you hear that did you hear that noise where is my volume at let me see i might have to turn this up a little bit um oh that is awesome okay so let's give a treat let's do oh we can't um oh we gotta go look okay but can we uh we can socialize let's do um hug brown hen look at this one they're so adorable where you going Meg? oh megan's about to pop out another baby <laughs> she's about to have another one we're not having any neighborhood brawls yet okay no 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 we're not we're not so we're gonna oh my goodness we gotta get a picture oh how gorgeous is this oh i love it so pretty oh but her eyes are closed oh can you open your eyes oh adorable okay and where's our other one at our other one is over here so let's do um socialize let's do a oh hold on what was that what was that ask chicken if it expects foul play all right we'll do that and then uh let's hug the brown rooster as well oh she changed her outfit <laughs> Aww. oh look at how they jump up oh they're so cute i love them i need to get a picture Oh, she looks so happy. Uh, look at her and her glasses on. Uh, hold on, that little kid is on the haystack back there sleeping. Oh, we're going to have to fix that, my friends. Aww. So we have that. So we need to socialize with a fox, rabbit, or bird three times. All right. So we are good with that. Um, we really need to go and put this poor kid to sleep. Oh, he is sound asleep on the haystack how stinking adorable is that go wake him up oh does he not have a bed that's why they don't have a bed all right let's go and get them a bed real quick okay so we added two beds but the next thing we have to do is socialize with a fox rabbit or a bird five times in henford on bagley click on a flock of wild birds fox or rabbit to interact with them tip if you're having trouble finding these creatures try revisiting bramblewood neighborhood all right let's go let's go take a look at bramblewood neighborhood bramblewood neighborhood let's go into the park we're gonna just go we're just gonna go we're gonna just send megan megan on over okay so we're in the forest ah oh, love it 
Okay, so let's see. Let's press play and let's see if we can try to find anything. I do. What do we see? Oh, it's so pretty here. She's going to go and try to eat something. Look at. Oh, found one. Oh, the little bunny. It's a it's a fox. Oh, the fox. Let's go and watch Maroon. Let's go watch Maroon real quick. Can we go find him? Can you walk over and say hi? I love this area. It's so gorgeous. Oh, here we go. We got birds over here. Okay, wherever he went. I don't know where he went. He like went super duper far. Ah, oh, we're going to have to walk. We're going to go into labor. <laughs> we keep walking. We're going to go into labor. We're going to have this baby here in the woods. Where did he go? Oh, he's all the way over there. All right. Oh, my goodness. No, stop it. Stop it. Okay, well, here. Let's go. Um, Let's watch the flock of wild birds. Hopefully, we don't get, like, attacked or anything like that. Look at the little birds. Ah, oh, can we do ask if birds are real? So, it's kind of like the scarecrow interaction. Oh my goodness, I love it. Oh. Okay, so let's socialize. Uh when we're done. Who this chrono? Ah. And talk about trees. And what else do we have? Uh give a gift. We can give them a meat meal. We can give them a turkey dinner. Oh, it's spoiled. We can't do that. <laughs> oh, no. She's so hungry. Talk about the trees. And what? Ah, uh, let's see. Um, ask if birds are real. That's so funny. She is going to pee herself. I'm sorry. You deserve. You deserve. No. Get back over here. Get back over here. Don't go anywhere. Um, I'm just going to cheat your needs real quick. Wherever they are make happy all right so let's talk about trees get back on over here guys we have one more time Ah. okay so she did that and um she can't really give a gift i could give insects i can give cricket flower Ugh. i don't think that's a good idea but, um, give a drink. Ah, oh, honey. No, won't do that anyway. All right. So let's see if we can find a bunny rabbit. Where can we find a bunny rabbit at? Let's go and take a look. We're going to go and press play. And let's just take a look at this beautiful area over here. Look at all the pretty flowers. Oh, look at this sign right here. That is so pretty. All right. I... Uh, so we're going to have to, what else are we going to have to do? We're going to have to look for these little bunny rabbits, which I don't see. I don't see anywhere, but what's this? Oh, wild blueberry. Let's harvest all. Yes, harvest those blueberries. Look at how gorgeous this is. I love all the flowers. So pretty. All right. Um... But yeah, let's do uh, discuss the dangers of migration. We can do that as well. We'll have her talk a little bit with the birdies and ask if birds are real and watch the flock of birds. All right, so she's going to do that. And I'm going to figure out where we can find some more bunnies at. Because I saw a fox, a creepy little fox, maroon. But we'll have to see. Uh, talking of Maroon, Maroon is right there. Hold on. He is a quick little suckeroo. <laughs> Looks more like a dog, to tell you the truth. No, I'm only kidding. Ah, that is not a good picture. Look, oh, he's evil looking. I don't like him. I don't like him. Ah, too close. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, he is. He's going to eat my chickens. Ah, don't you dare eat my chickens. Okay, we're going to have to get a llama when we go home. Oh, there goes another one. There. That's Oscar. Ah, 
Okay. This poor lady is going to go into uh, labor. I kid you not. She's going to have this baby. Oh, okay. Six hours. All right. Let's see. Uh, let's talk about music. And... Ask if Early Bird got the worm. Oh, there's such cute little interactions. Ah. Give a gift. I uh, give produce. Oh, let's give a blueberry. Ah. Oh, I don't think they like us. I got that little. Oh, they're like no way. No way, Jose. All right, so we're going to go head on back home since they don't like us. But before we go, we're going to go and search this uh, Sophie the Snail. We're going to go search and see what we can find. Sorry about that noise. One of my videos we're rendering. <laughs> All right, so let's go on over there. I still have yet to see a bunny rabbit. Whoa, this girl. Oh, my goodness. All those steps. I think I found something where... Did you not find anything? Think about a family member. Let's go search and see what it does. But then we're going to have to go all the way over here and let's... Oh. Search again. Oh. Who is this? Uh, the Finchuk Fair has started. Come win pr amazing prizes by competing in the competition. Oh. Hi. It's a friendly introduction to... Uh, what is your name? Your name is, you're going, you're walking too fast for me. Stop it. Would you please just stay still? Dad. Oh, this is Michael Bell. Hi, Michael. How are you today? Let's do, um, let's give a gift. Let's give a friendly gift. Let's give, uh, let's give some honey. Oh, so pretty. Hi. Now, can I get animal clothing for one of our animals? I don't think he really likes our gift. Okay. What can you show us? He really doesn't want anything to do with us. I'm going to have you teleport here. And I don't see any bunny rabbits. Oh, I don't know. All right, we should probably go home. Let's go on home, and I'll see you back at home, my friends. Okay, so we are back on home. I have yet to find a bunny, but we need to visit Finchwick, Old New Henford, and the Bramblewood neighborhood in Henford on Bagley. Okay, but before we do that, let's go collect our eggs. Let's go do that. Let's see what we have. It's a little laggy, I'll tell you that. Our game's a little laggy. Don't know if that's because of the update. But let's go take a look. A huge house. Oh, it's so big and beautiful. Okay, let's see. Aha. Aha. Oh, she has to pay. Did we get him? Yes, we got him. Where'd they go? Oh, we have one and it's excellent. Okay. So let's I don't know why she has to pay again. Um let's have her travel. And we're going to go on over to uh, Finch Wick. Let's go to Finch Wick. Let's do it. Let's go right here. Where? Right here. Right, right, right here. Yes. Right. No. Where are we supposed to go? Go to the bar? You really shouldn't be going to the bar when you're pregnant. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Well, we'll go on over. We'll head on over. All right. Oh, my goodness. She's about to pop. So where do we have to go? I think we have to go over this section right here. Okay. So, you know what? Let's put our egg in. Oh, look. Can we... Megan needs a fruit, a vegetable, and flour or herb in her inventory to participate. Oh, we have none of that. Does uh, does Tessa have anything? Oh, she does. Let's get Tessa to bring a potato. Let's submit an entry. Let's see what they choose for her. Hi, Tessa. Oh, this town is gorgeous. What do we have? Oh, we're going to bring in, uh, we're going to bring in a blackberry. Let's bring in a blackberry. All right. There goes our blackberry. All right. 
and view competition entry. Let's see what that says. Is anything going to pop up? Oh, who says pretty girl? Cecilia. Oh, she's so pretty. Well, I've tried. Someone grew this plant. Was it grown with love? Probably not, but they tried. They tried. Ah, look at how gorgeous she is. She is beautiful. Oh, look at those mushrooms. I love it. I love it. Okay, so um, that is our entry. Let's go take a look over at these stalls over here. Oh, we have this stall over here. All right, that's so cute. Hours of operation is 9 a.m. to 7 p.m., so we just missed it. So these are closed. Okay, but there is a moodlet I believe you could get from window shopping. Ah, oh, let's do it. All the Sims are so pretty looking. We're going to go see what we have right now. Excited competitor. Tessa is feeling good about her chance at winning. I love it. What is this? Oh, a wild raspberry. Well, hold on. Let's have Megan. Let's have Megan. Um, Oh, look at this uproot plant. Oh, that's new. I like that. Oh, you're at the bar. Get out of the bar. You're not supposed to be in the bar. Oh, let's see what kind of mood that she gets. Uh, born fair entry. What? There's nothing special about this fairs competition. Uh, where are the interest in submissions? Don't Sims have pride anymore? What? Oh, let's see what pops up. We have a retail therapy. What adorable shops. Tessa had a blast browsing the local wares. Nice. All right. So I don't know. Oh my goodness. You can fish here. Oh my gosh. That is gorgeous. Oh my goodness. That is just absolutely gorgeous. Let's go take a little tour around. Oh, she's still window shopping. All right. But these are really cute shops. I don't think you can go into any of them. Actually, before we even decide, you can change your outfit. You can plan outfits and you can window shop. All right. So let's go take a look. Uh, what else do we have? Um, I think this was a, a wish and wow of some sort. It's not interactive. No. But how long is our entry going on for? We have some people who did a Wolf Spain. We have a pineapple here. We have the village mayor, Lavina Capra. Yes. Hi. Can we go do a friendly introduction to her? Oh, I really hope our... Oh, are we dancing over here? Oh, how cute is that? Ah. Uh, oh, that is so cool. Who's this? This is grocery delivery. Raul. The festival will end in one hour. Okay. We're all dancing. Well, let's come over here and dance too. Let's go dance. Listen to Cottage Core. Go for it. Get in the mood, my friend. We still have to pee? I don't know when this uh, ends over here. But, it, oh, we have, oh, we ha I'm sorry. We have pies. We have a lemon meringue pie. We also have a cottage pie. What? Oh, all this seems so good. Oh, so very good. When is it going to end? It's 10 o'clock. Wait, hold on. Who was that? The garden shop owner, Agatha Crumplebottom. Can we do a friendly introduction instead of dance and go say hi? They're looking at our, our blackberries here. I love that. I love that. All right, so this is the Finch Wink Fair. We haven't really uh, noticed anything just yet, like what's going on with our little uh, competition here. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go switch on over to Caleb real quick. And we're going to go have a look to see what he is up to. I love the sounds that these chickens make. Bok, 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 uh, bok, bok. Um, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> let's go ahead and feed the chickens my friends one is sleeping but caleb let's go and feed the chicken i wonder if the kiddo can do something can we bok bok to brown hen yes let's bok bok okay all right let's go do that caleb wherever you are oh goodness gracious oh can you put the feed down oh that is so cool oh look at the little feed call chickens to eat Oh, look at that. Oh, I love it. Buck, buck. Uh, let's give a treat. Uh, can't do a treat. Let's, uh, can we socialize? Let's, uh, pet brown hen and let's play with brown hen, brown rooster. Oh, this is so adorable. I love it. So I was looking 
and I would like to upgrade this, but we're going to have to wait a little bit. So you can trade for animal treats, ingredients, meat, and simoleons. We're not going to do that. But to upgrade, oh, 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 okay, lock that. To upgrade, you have to, uh, Caleb is missing some required items. So we would like to get the beacon alarm for the foxes. So we need three livestock livestock upgrade parts. Comfort Care Life Extender, uh, two livestock upgrade parts. And for the Coop Auto Feeder, it's six livestock upgrade parts. So we would have to acquire these parts from the villagers in Henford on Bagley. All right. So this little one is just really going to make a mess, right? What are you doing? You're, what, what are you doing? This child is walking on the furniture in the house. Like, what, what are you up to? Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go and we're going to have uh, Megan over here. Let's purchase a llama, a beige llama or a white llama. Let's get a beige llama. Let's do it. Uh, call over beige llama. <gasps> oh my gosh, that is so cool. Oh, so pretty. What can we do? We can feed the beige llama ah socialize let's ask if llama got its groove back did you get your groove back ah uh, i don't know about you you got your groove because you've been moving and you've been walking all day my friend been walking so much this this first part is all over the place we'll get the hang of it though oh let's get a picture why not ah is it kissing my belly it's kissing my belly Oh, that's so cute. Oh my goodness. If that's an interaction, I love that. <gasps> what else can we do? Uh, socialize. Let's pet. And let's do hug. Oh, I hope you like us. Oh, oh, so funny. Hi, how are you? Are oh, you so cute? Oh, no. Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> He just spit on us. Why'd you spit? That was not very nice. Uh, undrama the llama. Go for it. Undrama the llama. It's not very nice. Ah, oh, don't give me, don't give me that, that eyeballs. Where you going? You're leaving me? You're leaving me? Fine. See you later. See you later. All right, y'all. All right, my friends. I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I hope you're not like going crazy like Chris is. Uh, it was a very fun part. The world is absolutely beautiful. This lot, I think, uh, for a family that we have, we are a family of five, almost six. It is huge. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to go ahead and let them stay here. Uh, or maybe I might just change my mind. Or we'll, you know what? In the next part, we're going to go take a look at a different family. Go look around. Go take a tour of Henford on Bagley, but I thank you all for watching this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up and let me know down in the comments down below what you are so excited for. Are you excited for the alligators? Are you excited for the llamas? Um, I think it's a really cool game. It is a little glitchy. As you can tell, we had one of the toddlers running on furniture, but so far it looks good. We have so much more to explore, so I will see you all in the next video. See you later, my friends. Bye.